Okay, uh, in this video, uh, we'll talk about uh, how change of variables uh, rules applies for multivariable integration. Uh, so the first thing you will see is something called Jacobian. So we ask the question, if uh, x is a function of u and v and y is a function of u and v, then uh, how does dx dy change in integration in terms of uh, uh, integration, uh, in terms of u and v? Uh, so basically we ask the question, uh, dx dy can be written as uh, what times what times du dv okay and the answer to this comes from Jacobian so this what comes here is Jacobian actually it's the absolute value of the Jacobian Jacobian times du dv and what is Jacobian Jacobian is simply, uh, you look, look at the partial matrix of partial derivatives of x with respect to u and v. So you create this matrix, del x, del u, del y, del, uh, no, 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 not that. It's actually del x, del u, and del x, del v. And in the second row, we have del y, del u, and second entry in the second row is del y del v okay you form this matrix and it takes its determinant okay so the Jacobian is actually the determinant of this matrix okay so let's see an example so we ask the question in this uh, in this slide is if x is half times u plus v and y is half u minus v then what's the Jacobian in this case so like we said we will have to make a matrix of partial derivative of x and y with respect to u and v first row r is uh, entries in the first rows are the partial derivatives of x with respect to u and v so it's x del x del u and the second entry in the first row is del x del v okay in the second row you differentiate the second variable that is y in this case so it's del y del u and del y del v okay we can easily calculate this for this given x and y so del x del u is half del x del v is minus one half uh, del y del u is one half and del y del v is uh, del y del v is minus one half actually sorry it's the del x del v should be positive one half okay the Jacobian is actually is the determinant of this matrix one half one half one half minus one half so that will be minus one over two okay so what we say here is the dx dy should become more of minus one half du dv so that it should be one half du dv okay so it's simple as that if x is a function of u and v and y is a function of u and v, the dx dy should be Jacobian times du dv. Okay. So in the next video, we will see an example of using this Jacobian for multivariable integration.